just hoping and praying this shit don't take me out. You know what I'm saying? Don't take me out. Uh, muy gusto. Uh, y'all, why the line would be this long? Like, this is crazy. This has been since I took the vaccine and. Right. We love a man with his life together, that's for sure. I've been on the road, I've been doing shows. Now we ain't steak, remember sleeping on the floor. We're still at the gas station when the town's cold. In the kitchen, hostel, trying to flip it out the stove. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Raquel. If this is your first time clicking on my video, then welcome. Make sure you hit the subscribe button right down below so you don't miss another upload. So I have been down in Savannah. This is actually my first Savannah vlog because I've been down here. We've been down here for a week. Today is Tuesday, so we've been down here for a while. It's already done. This is why I don't want to start the vlog. But anyway, we've been down here for a whole week already. And I didn't get to film anything because, y'all, I forgot my uh, battery charger and Charlotte in the room. And I left it plugged into the wall and I forgot to get it. So I literally just ordered one today. Um, just because I was trying to take like a little small break. Um, I haven't even been that productive with editing videos. But yeah, I figured off the, I start the vlog. And I had like two bars of my battery left, but it's already currently dying. So, this is just the intro, y'all. I'll probably see y'all in two days. Today's Tuesday. I'll probably see y'all Thursday because that's when I get my new battery and battery charger. I'm honestly not doing nothing right now. I'm just going to pick us up something to eat. Um, about to go into Kroger and then get me, of course, some Starbucks coffee. And yeah, that's it. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. I told y'all my camera died and it's still dead, but this is my phone. So I'm actually about to go into CVS and get my shot today. <laughs> I'm honestly sad. Um, I don't feel like I really explained me getting a shot or not getting a shot on the channel. I just really had no desire for a really long time to get it. I still don't truly have a desire. It's just that, you know, I'm traveling right now. And at this point, like eventually it's probably going to be like mandatory and most for most things like to be doing things or whatever so i'm just gonna get it out the way and i just don't god forbid i don't want to catch you know covid and just not have it so i'm about to go get my first shot y'all because we're still down here and then we're gonna be in dr and next in september so i'm about to get the moderna shot just hoping and praying this shit don't take me out you know what i'm saying don't take me out i hope i'm be okay i've already kind of felt oh, i don't know if that's bad but I think it was because I was drinking the other day. I had kind of like a, it felt like a head cold. And I had a stuffy nose a little bit, but I'm okay. But I just hope it don't make like the symptoms worse. So yeah, it's five o'clock. Well, my appointment's at five, it's 5.54. So I'm about to walk in here. And then my second one will probably be, I'm gonna have to stretch it until after I come back from DR because none of the places at home, like once I go home to get my second shot, none of them have any open availability. So I guess we shall see. Hey y'all, your girl got a battery. Woo! So uh, yeah, welcome back to the vlog. It's been a few days, but um, today is Friday. Um, I'm about to, Corey just got back home not too long ago. So I'm about to just go out. I really want to go to Starbucks and just kind of finish uploading my video, but I don't know if Starbucks is open on the inside or not, but I'm about to see um, if they are or not. So I'm about to drive out, have a day, a little time to myself. Might go get a drink or not, I don't know. This vaccine, you know what I'm saying? I just got a few days ago. But anyway, we about to be out. All right, y'all, I'm about to go into Cheddar's on my own solo a date. It's just me. Um, I got my laptop. I don't even know if they really have Wi-Fi. I think they do, but we gotta see. But I also got my little notebook so I can just kind of just chill, have some time to myself. But I gotta pee first.
Okay, y'all, so I finished my dinner. I wanted to stay a little bit longer to kind of chill out, but I just don't feel good. Ever since I took that vaccine, like, I had a random, like, rash, like, I don't remember if I showed y'all earlier. It was like rash on my knee. It's still kind of there. It like went away for the most part. So you can see like, it's like irritation on my leg, random. And it's, on, it's like on my knee, like on both knees. Who gets random irritation on their knees? I don't know. Um, I literally had a half a drink <laughs> because I couldn't even finish it. Like my head just felt so tight. I don't know what's going on and I don't like it. My stomach's hurting, but then also like my period is supposed to be coming. So I don't know if I'm just having like weird PMS symptoms. I don't know, but like, I feel like a lot of pressure on my head and I don't feel good. Like, I just don't feel good. So I'm probably about to go back. Corey about to be mad, but I'm about to come back and lay down. Cause I gotta stop at Target real quick, but I feel like my stomach is done hurt, so I might be getting my period too, so maybe that could be it. All right, y'all, so I just got back from Target. Um, I got a new set of pajamas for here because I needed them, and I'd be cold, so I got like a long sleeve set that's cute. I tried it on to fit, so I'm gonna wash it. And I got like a mom bathing suit. It's kind of like this color, a little bit lighter. Um, I just gotta change the top. I had extra large bottoms, but like, huh? Anyway, so I got a few things. I picked up this Dove exfoliating body polish um, just to exfoliate my skin because I realized like I have really, what's the word I'm looking for? Ingrown hair, like my skin is prone to get ingrown hairs. I realized I even get them on my thighs, like when I shave like right here. Like I had a bunch of ingrown hairs that I was like picking at today. So I need to exfoliate my skin more often. I really don't. Um, and I really want to get into waxing, especially, um, bikini waxing because I'm prone to ingrown hairs down there too. They'll be extra, but you know, everybody's different. Everybody's skin is different. My skin is like sensitive. So, yeah. So, and I also got this EOS shave cream that I got. I need to do, I still shave my underarms and stuff too. I got a new razor because the one that I got is a little too sharp, I feel like. So this is the Flamingo Shaver, and then I got this new Gillette Venus Daily Soothing Serum. Just to help, you know, like, yes. How you even get in here? Daddy wants you. I don't really know if it's worth the amount. It was, it was like $14. But it's, a, it's a nice tube, and I was like, dang, I'm going to try it. Because the exfoliant, I felt like, mm, whatever. So I'm going to try, I'm about to try the exfoliators today. Um, I need to shave my arms and stuff. And then I'll let you guys know how, like, I mean, you, I'm pretty sure a lot of you have used this Dove before. But yeah, I haven't tried it. So I'm about to get in the shower, put on some music, and get my body care going. It is the next day. Today is Saturday. Um, Corey is at work, but he gets off around three. We're supposed to be going to the pool today with his nieces, but I'm not really sure. Like, I gotta wait to see if that's still the plan. But me and Carter just been hanging out. We haven't been doing nothing, y'all. Um, I'm about to pretty much kind of like edit some videos. We like, you know, got dressed but didn't get dressed. But yeah, um, it was really nice out outside earlier. It was like nice and blue, blue skies and everything. But now it's like cloudy. So I don't know. I know it's still hot though because it says it feels like 100 degrees. So regardless, it's still a nice day to go to the pool. Carter is watching his tablet and watching eating hot dogs. And I'm just about to be productive for like an hour before Corey gets home. So, Whew. what was that? Nothing. What you say? 
Nothing, dear. What is that? Como te llamo? Que hora es? What is that? What you was talking about? Habla? Te he a trabajo muy gusto. Uh, we'll get tequila the the mi hermana mi hermano uh, se 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 with the abuela your brother is with your grandma Todd is going with his grandma it's the past tense it's like you gotta he's not your hermano is, hermano is son no that's mijo. brother oh mijo Mijo is abuela casa. Anyway, um, we're about to go drop Carter off at his grandma's house. I gotta go run to Target real quick. Um, Corey's gonna, we're gonna have a bet real quick uh, of how long it takes me to exchange one item in Target and to get a hair product. I say seven minutes. What you saying? The bet is seven minutes. Oh, the bet is seven minutes. So if I'm over seven minutes, then I lose. What's the real bet, Corey? What's if you if you win, then what? Yeah, think about it. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna think about mine too. If I win, you tell me you lost my card. I did not lose your card. You you had your card when you put gas in the car at Parker. You forgot. You went in there and got lemonade. So that's your fault. I never lose my car. Somehow when Raquel's here, <laughs> my car always ends up missing. Well, that was your son the first time. Well, we better find it before. For what, Patron? No, I can just, I mean, you you got that. Huh? Drinks $2. Oh. Uh. No, my drinks are two dollars. You order. Like, no, I'm gonna order a two dollar drink. Why she text you for that? Right. Cause she miss you. She miss you. Cause she can find out information anyway. Cause she could have googled it. Yeah. All right, it's six oh nine. I'm gonna leave at six ten so that I can meet. So six seventeen. Okay. Okay. To six seven. To the car. To get to the car. Yeah. yeah okay. Alright, since I said six ten. <laughs> Alright y'all. <laughs> I literally have seven minutes. Alright, I have a game plan. This is my game plan. I'm gonna go get the exchange of the bikini first. Because I just gotta get a large and then I'm gonna go get the hair thing because that's right across. And I'm gonna just take both of them over here and pay and then I should be good. So that's gonna be the game plan. But we're gonna see if it's gonna actually hurt because I really don't know. I need a large. Yo, my whole shit is broke. That's crazy. Large. Let me make sure this is actually large on the thing now. Ew, come on. The only large they have, this is actually a small on the wrong anger please don't tell me they don't have a um y'all medium medium oh you motherfuckers they don't have it they don't have the large well now i'm definitely gonna beat corey because they don't even have the stuff i was going to um exchange for so now I'm just looking for something real quick to just use for my scalp, which I usually get this because this is actually pretty good. But let me see if there's anything else that I want to get slash try. I mean, how much time I got? Four minutes, y'all. We're just gonna go with the extra dollars or chill. I'm gonna just go with what I know for right now. Y'all, why the line would be this long? Like, this is crazy. Okay, this line could possibly go fast. Oh my God. All right, y'all, I literally got two minutes. I don't even know if y'all can see it. Two minutes. 
and I'm at a register because everybody in the stuff is taking mad long. Like, so I'm hoping I can run back and make it. Oh my god, it's 6 16. <gasps> okay, she's checking out. Hold on, I gotta see because this is really stressing me out. <laughs> it's 6 16, y'all. Wait, I'm gonna have to jet across. <laughs> <laughs> literally as I'm outside literally as I'm outside literally <laughs> hey I made it alright y'all we out with the fam we about to go to a place called Patron it's a Mexican plant Mexican bar two dollar margaritas Corey how many you gonna have why well, I can't vlog? Hey. Y'all, we just came for Patron. Well, I'm, I'm just in the car. I'm waiting for Corey to get to the car. Um, but yeah, that was nice. Went out with the fam. Had some drinks. We ate. It's 9 o'clock. Perfect timing. Not too late. About to go home and relax because I'm tired. And tomorrow's going to be a productive day. I'm so excited. I'm going to take you guys. I'm going to a co-working space. So there's one downtown. Oh, excuse me, in Savannah, so I paid $30, $30 for a day pass from 9 to 5, so I'm able to do a bunch of stuff I need to do, and hopefully it'll motivate me because I'm in, like, an actual working space and everything, so I'm really, really excited. I need to edit some videos, I need to update a lot of things just on my just brand side, I guess, um, but yeah, so we're about to go back to the house, chill out. Um, I feel good because the last few days I couldn't really drink like that, but now I feel fine. I think because I was like slow drinking. But I was trying to do that the other day and I didn't feel good, but I feel fine now, so yeah. You okay? Mm-hmm. Now, Corey bad, y'all. He over here drinking after he took his vaccine yesterday. It's FDA. Um, only the Pfizer one, not the Moderna. Oh, you don't want to get the one that's going to kill me. No. The Moderna one is better, technically. Why I ain't got when is when when first. is the okay? But why the FDA don't even approve nothing good anyway? They be approving stuff and it still be bad for you. So what's the difference? Right. Right. Hey y'all. Good morning. It's the next day. Um, I am on my way to the co-working space, but I'm about to go to CVS, y'all, because I don't I don't remember if I showed y'all, but my hands. Let me see if y'all can see it. For my hands look like this. Um, this has been since I took the vaccine, and it's really itchy. <laughs> Um, it hurts honestly now I have like hand eczema which is like and it's usually under the skin and sometimes it looks like this that's fine but like on the back of my hand I've never had it like this so my cousin and my grandma I think it's an allergic reaction to something in the vaccine so I'm about to go and see like what the pharmacist thinks or whatever if I need to go to urgent care and get something prescribed or if there's something I can just use maybe if I could just maybe I just need Benadryl I don't really know um I don't have like shortness of breath or anything but I just my hands it, it, it's getting worse it's definitely getting worse it was just a little bit before but now I feel like it's getting worse I don't know what's going on with this vaccine but I don't got time so yeah that's what I'm about to do I'm about to go to CVS now and then we're gonna be going downtown to the co-working space now this is only on my hands and my knees y'all I don't really know why it's only on my hands and my knees, but it's only on my hands and my knees. I mean, my scalp has been really itchy, but I do think this is because <laughs> my hair, my scalp was dry, so I just moisturized it. I don't think I have like any reaction to my scalp, which would be weird, but I don't know. So I'm literally about to go down the street and see what they say because it hurts like, not like excruciating, it's just uncomfortable for me to like close my hand and stuff because it's like tight, like, so I try to keep it moisturized, but it's not like that's really fully helping either, so. Hey guys, so I am in the co-working space. I just got down here. Oh, so I went in and they just told me to try Benadryl and cortisone on my hands, so if I put some cortisone on it. I mean, I guess it stopped the itching a little bit, but I'm gonna take the Benadryl tonight because I need to be up right now. But um, the co-working space is really, really nice. My little, 
like a big one of those really big chairs. My stuff on the table, there's an outlet over there, so I'm probably gonna have to switch to this side eventually, but it's cool. Um, but there's like a kitchen over there, there's like offices, there's like a whole lobby thing, so it's really, really nice. So I'm about to get a bunch of work done. I'll be here for most of the day, so I'll check in and out with you guys. Hello friends, um, I am still here at the co-working space. My dilemma is, well first off, I just finished a vlog, which I'm happy about. Um, I'm not gonna edit another one. I'm going to update my cal content calendar. And um, I got three more hours left, y'all. So, I mean, I'm really hungry, to be honest. I don't know if I can order food and they can bring it up. But, like, nobody else is really eating, so I'm gonna be that one person and have a whole bomb ass meal and, you know, it smells like food in here. So, I'm trying not to be that person. So, I think I could suppress my hunger for like another hour or two. If I could be done by four and then just go eat, I think that's fine. But I think I did a good amount today. I got this done. I'm about to update this content calendar and stuff. I really think I'm gonna come back on Thursday, but um, yeah. It's been good. This is like perfect. I wish they had these where I was at at home. But um, yeah. I have never had a video upload in 10 minutes ever, y'all. Ever. This shit dead about to upload in 10 minutes. That's how you know this Wi-Fi fast as fuck. Hey friends. So I didn't update y'all. But I've been back at Corey since like 3.30. 3.34. Um, I couldn't, I really had to eat because I didn't eat anything while I was at the co-working space. So I went to trailer park and I ate and like my, I just, my body wasn't feeling right. So I came back here, took a Benadryl, laid down and like I slept, but it was a terrible nap, like terrible. Like right now I have a headache. I feel like the Benadryl ain't really kicking. Like, I don't know what is going on, but this shit is ghetto. It's really ghetto. Um, I'm hungry now. I don't know what we're gonna eat. Corey went to go pick up Carter. He actually came home early, so I don't even know. Y'all just, I don't feel good. Hey y'all, so it is the next day. Today is Wednesday, the 25th. Um, we are actually going to pick up Corey from work. And then I'm probably gonna go to the urgent care and just see if there's any like cream or something that they can give me to help my rash go away. Um, I've been using that cortisone that I got yesterday, but the rash spread to my elbow. I don't know if you can see it. And yeah, I mean, it seems like it's going away a little bit. Like this isn't as bad as yesterday, but I mean, I don't know. I can't really tell if it's really going away or not. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do today. Two more days until Carter's birthday, y'all. So, yeah, we're about to leave and get some coffee. And then we're gonna head over to pick up Corey. <laughs> Good morning. I literally just woke up like 20 minutes ago. So I just wanted to close out this vlog because we're about to start a new vlog. It's Thursday. It's the day before Carter's birthday. So I'm about to start a birthday vlog. We're doing a little trip and everything. So I'm going to take y'all along. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this whatever like spacey as week in the life in Savannah. We didn't really didn't do anything. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Been doing me, living my life like it's carefree, dancing and smiling. I'm no longer crying because all of the people that kept on with lying are out of my life. Now I'm living right. I'm solo and I'll be, and I know God got me. Won't deal with the strife.